Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log a raised to power x equals to log 60 here. The next step here, we apply the power of log n. When we have log m raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. That is, yeah, we have x log 8 equals to log 60 from here. As this next step here, we divide both sides by log 8. Divide this side by log 8. Also divide this side by log 8. Which implies... We have log 8 cancelled each other here. That is x equals to log 60 over log 8. Then, next step here, we can write 60 as 4 times 15. That is here, we have x equals to log 4 times 15 over log 8. That is, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this is the same thing as log a plus log b. That is, all we have here becomes x equals to log 4 plus log 15 over log eight then next step here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log four over log eight plus log fifteen over log eight Next step here, also, we can write 15 as 3 times 5. That is, this equation becomes x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 times 5 over log 8. That is, here, this also follows the law of logarithm. And this becomes x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 8. Then, from what we have here, we separate this into two fractions. And we have x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8. Then, yeah, we can write 4 as 2 times 2, that's 2 square. Also, 8 as 2 times 2 times 2, that's 2 cube. Then, what we have becomes x equals to log 2 squared over log 2 cube plus log 3 over log 2 cube plus log 5 over log 2 cube. Then here we apply the power law of logarithm. 2 comes here, 3 comes here, 3 comes here, and also 3 comes here. Then we have x equals to 2 log 2 over 3 log 2 plus log 3 over 3 log 2 plus log 5 over 3 log Two. Then from here we have log two cancelled each other. Two over three left. That is x equals to two over three. Plus here we can write this as one over three times log three 
on va log 2, plus also 1 over 3 times log 5, over log 2. Then, here we apply change of base. That is, when we have log A over log B, this is the same thing as log A to base B. That is, yeah, what we have becomes x equals to 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 3 base 2 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2. Then, yeah, we bring this together as one fraction and we have x equals to the yeah, same here as 3. Then, here yeah, becomes 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. That is the value of x here we have 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Then what we have here becomes 8 raised to power x, which is 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. All over 3 is this equals to 60 on this side. That is next step here. We can express it as 2 cube, which is raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 60 on this side? And this power multiplies 3 here comes to each other. All we have becomes 2 raised to the power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then we apply the law of indices here. When we have a raised to the power m plus n, this same thing as a raised to the power m times a raised to the power n. Then what we have here becomes 2 squared times 2 raised to the power log. 3 base 2 times 2 raised to the power log 5 base 2 is it equals to 60 on this side. Then here 2 square that's 4. Then times this follows when we have a raised to the power log b to base a, which is equals to b. This here we have 3 times. Here we have 5. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then 4 times 3, that's 12. And 12 times 5, that's 60, which is equal to 60 from the left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 2 plus log 3 is 2 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.